Hi everyone, this is Keep It Real. I'm going to do a collector reading for all Zodiac signs for November the 16th to November the 18th, 2021. I hope all is well with you guys. I hope you stay positive, protected, blessed, and prayed up. And keep your guards all the way up, okay? Alright, spirit guides, my God, the angel or angel ancestors, my God, angel, Holy Spirit. What are the general reading for all Zodiac signs? General reading for all zodiac signs, spirit guys. General reading for all zodiac signs. What is going on with all zodiac signs? What is all zodiac signs thinking, feeling, doing, to going through from November 16th to November the 18th, 2021? General reading for all zodiac signs. What is all zodiac signs thinking, feeling, doing, what are they up to? What are they going through? All zodiac signs. General reading for all zodiac signs. This all zodiac signs think of feeling doing what are they up to? What are they going through? All zodiac signs. General reading for all zodiac signs. General reading for all zodiac signs. Thank you, spirit. So let's cut general reading for all zodiac signs for November 16th. Till November 18, 2021. Two of Wands. Fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Someone's watching you, looking at you. Okay. This, could, this can be an ex of yours. Or someone that you know. A secret admirer or a stranger or who whatsoever. Or this is someone's watching you, looking at you. Okay. Or this can be you looking at different locations where to move. You want to move somewhere closer or close to someone, okay? This is you. This is someone looking at you, okay? Like I said, this could be an ex of yours, a secret admirer, someone that's very wealthy and well established, okay? This could be someone that wants to talk to you, do business with you, whatsoever, okay? All right. King of Swords, this is Aquarius, so this is going to be any sign. Someone's feeling cold-hearted towards you, very demanding, disrespectful, okay? This is someone is very controlling and bossy. Or this can be someone ain't taking no bullshit off of you anymore. They tired of the fuckery. They, you know, they got their sword off. They cutting your ass off. You know, this can be someone cutting motherfuckers off. They don't mean them good or whatsoever, Okay, this is you have to cut people out of your life in order to move forward. This is what you have to do. But also, this is the ace of, uh, I mean, it's a king of swords. Someone's very demanding, you know, very domineering, loves to control people as well. Loves to boss people around. This can be a narcissist. This can be an abuser, abusive person as well. Okay. We had the four ones. Queen of Cups, Cancer. So, four ones, okay? So, you moving to a new home, new residence, new relationship. You can be married. You can be moving away, out of town, out of the city, to another state or whatsoever. Okay? This can be you starting all over again, new love. Okay, we have a Queen of Cups. This is a Cancer. This is someone's watching you. They're watching your relationship. Okay, this is you. This is someone watching you. They're watching your relationship. They watch you be happy. They're watching you to move on. This could be someone's ex, a mother, a grandmother, or an older woman, a younger woman. This could be someone probably watching a man, sees a man with you. Or uh, something. This is someone's watching you. This can be a family member, a friend, a friend of me, enemy, whosoever that's jealous of you, envy of you. And you see how they're watching you? They're watching you move on. They watch you be happy. Okay. This is someone's watching you, stalking you. They can be giving you the evil eye. Like I said, they can be jealous of your relationship. Okay. We have the devil. This can be a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, or this can be any sign. This is jealousy, envy. Deception, lies, abusive, domestic violence. This is someone's very controlling. Okay, like to um 
do dirty shit to people, very deceptive, not loyal, not honest. This is someone you can't, you know, depend on. This is someone that will stab you in the back, very jealous of you, envy of you, like a narcissistic, okay? Capricorn card, or well, it's going to be any sign. You could be around a group of people that's toxic and negative as hell, okay? That's talking shit about you, trying to hold you back, trying to keep you from moving forward, Okay, they can be toxic, toxic people. You can be in a toxic relationship, abusive relationship. Like I said, someone that don't want to see you move forward. This is someone deceiving you behind your back, doing shit behind your back. Okay, the world car. You need to get away. You need to travel. You need to move away from these people or this person. Okay. Yeah, overseas and trips and money. So if you get away from this Capricorn or whoever this sign, these people is, things are going to look better for you. You need to move forward. You need to move forward. You need to get out this toxic ass relationship. You need to move forward. If you want to travel, travel, go. If you have to leave this person, you have to leave town. Get the hell away from this person or these people. Okay. I just said it, Ten of Wands. It's going to be a Leo any sign. You're walking away. You're moving forward. This is someone's walking away. They're tired of the bullshit. It's too much burden on them. They're tired of arguing and fighting. They're tired of the nick natty, patty ratty. They're just tired of the immature, childish, petty mind games. This is going to be a Leo walking away or this is going to be any sign. Someone's taking their shit and they up like 7-Up. They don't give a fuck. Okay? This is someone said they had enough and they gone. Like the Twilight Zone. <laughs> Ace of Swords. Victory. Success. So do what you got to do to cut whoever out whatsoever out your life that reach victory or to become successful or to reach your goal or whatsoever. So hello, victory. It is yours. Okay? Frustration. You got people that are trying to give you problems, bring you problems. They see you moving forward. They see you trying to do something with your life. Okay? And they want to come in and make you know, stagnation for you. They want to bring frustration. They want to come in and, and try to stop you, try to slow you down or whatsoever. This is you have to put your sword up. Let a motherfucker know where you stand. You got to put them in their place. Let them know don't cross this line, okay? If you got to do what you got to do to move forward or to be successful, if you got to cut people out of your life that they that don't belong in your life, that can't go with you, you got to drop them like it's hot, drop them like a bad habit or whatsoever, Nine of Cups. This is money improving. Money looks good. More money on the way. This could be a Pisces or any sign. Someone's feeling smudged and pleased, satisfied, happy. They're feeling good. Okay. This is someone uh, that can have a crush on you. They can be undressing you with their eyes, fantasizing about you. They can have a crush. Like I said, they can like you, very attracted to you. And when they see you, just do something to them. Okay. You know what I mean? So this could be someone that. Very attracted to you. This could be an ex of yours, a secret of mine, someone that got a crush on you. Or this is someone addicted to you. They could be addicted to your sex. They could be addicted to just being around you. You make them feel some kind of way. You make them feel good. You just make them feel pleased. Or this could be someone with a sex problem, a sex addiction, someone that likes to sleep around with a lot of people a lot, like to have sex with a lot of people a lot. Okay. Uh, they can be, they like, some people like to have. <laughs> This is going to be someone that like the same sex. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is going to be someone that like the same sex. Okay? Like men, men, women, women. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is going to be someone sleeping around for money. Has sex for money. It can be stripping, escorting, or whatsoever. You know, they feel smug. They feel pleased about the job that they do, the work that they do, how they make their money, whatsoever. If you ain't hurting nobody, killing nobody, so fuck them. You know? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Okay, I mean, I'm not saying I do. I don't do that. But hey, if that's what you do, that's what you do. Can nobody knock nobody? Okay, so stop. Hey, man, this is someone trying to put shit on hold for you. Slow you down, slow down your progress. This is someone trying to cause stagnation in your life. This is someone, like I said, trying to cause delays in your life. You know, just this also can be you need to uh, put shit on hold. It's a reason why shit is a delay. It's a reason why things are on hold. Your relationship can be on hold. Or you can be put a relationship on hold. 
okay? But this is something that's on hold right now. It could be money, a relationship, or a business, or whatsoever, okay? But it can be also someone trying to cause you delays in your life. Someone's trying to have shit slow down for you. Someone trying to make you wait. This is someone trying to keep things stressful. This is someone is just, I don't know, stupid, ignorant. They just trying to cause you issues in your life. The hermit. This is someone's being sneaky, up to no good. This is a Virgo, or it's gonna be any sign. This is someone spying on you, stalking you behind scene, being sneaky, hiding shit. Okay, this can be someone doing spell work on you. It can be a private investigator watching you, stalking you. Okay, this can be a serial killer, a pedophile, a sex offender, somebody behind scene watching you, or this can be someone suffering in silence, someone wants to be alone, someone working on a project or a career behind scene, or this can be someone doing readings on you, going to a tarot card reader to do readings on you, or whatsoever. Like I said, this could be someone going to a graveyard, doing spell work on somebody, you know, covering up something, hiding something, burying something, okay, like I said, this could be someone, like I said, they could be watching you behind scene. I don't know. Maybe you inspire them, or they could, like I said, they it could be an enemy or friend of me. Okay. Ten of Pentacles. Money looks good. This could be someone spying on your money, watching you. This, like I said, this could be someone watching your money, spying on your money. Okay, behind scene, trying to see how they take your money. This could be someone looking at your Ten of Pentacles. Okay, this could be Ten of Pentacles. It could be a new love, a new relationship. Someone's coming in. Okay, they want to work on things with you. They want to, your forgiveness. They want to apologize to you. They want to do business with you. They want to invest some type of business or relationship or career with you. Okay, this could be a new love, a twin flame, a uh, family member, friend who so else someone need to play stay need your help. Okay, um, like I said, this could be a new love. Okay, or this is someone who wants to do business with you. Be careful. Make sure you read. Whatever you need to read on the fine print before you sign your signature whatsoever, be careful with people coming in your life. Might want your ten of pentacles, trying to scam you out your money, trying to take your money. Just be careful, you know. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, just be careful, okay? <laughs> Ooh, Lord, have a mercy. Temperance, somebody's very protected, okay? You can be an earth angel. You can be chosen, a star seed. You're protected by your guiding angels, your earth angels, your ancestors, your spirit guides, Michael the Archangel, Holy Spirit. Call on your guiding angels for guidance, directions, and protection and healing, okay? Whatever you're going through, if you're having some type of drug problem, addiction, drinking too much, smoking too much, get some help, need meditate, okay? Turn to your spirit guides. Go you might need to get checked out at a hospital. You might need to go to an AA meeting, an alcohol anonymous group or something. Okay. Uh, <laughs> but listen, you are protected. Okay. All right. Please listen. Stop spending money. Stop spending all your money. Slow down on spending. Slow down spending your money on useless shit. Worthless shit. You know what I'm saying? So spirits that call on your guardian angels, your ancestors, pray, meditate. You probably need to detox your body and stuff like that, okay? Do some cleansing. Pray to your guardian angels, all right? <laughs> or this could be a Sagittarius or somebody that you know that's an alcoholic, that need an alcohol drug, that have addiction, that need help. Okay, I'm back to... <laughs> Seven of Pentacles. This could be a Virgo, any sign. Someone's looking at their money. Someone's looking at their business, their property. They're trying to see how they can earn more money. How can they get this business done? How can they fix this? How can they get the money for this? This could be also someone looking at their appearance, their body, their weight. How can they lose weight? They thinking about having surgery. You thinking about getting money. Getting some body surgery, you want to change your breast, your ass, your body, you want to lose weight, you, you know, stuff like that. You want to change your appearance, or you can be looking at yourself like, uh, I rather I, I want to do this person is attracted to me. You could be how you could be feeling kind of insecure about your body, about your looks, how you know, in front of someone, or your boyfriend or girlfriend, or you can be feeling a little insecure, or this could be someone making you feel insecure about your looks, about your appearance. Okay, they're trying to make you feel low. So you won't go to nobody else. So, you, you know, you know, you can be in a relationship that's very, that's, 
toxic, as someone jealous of you, and they'll try to tell you bad things and make you feel bad so you won't feel good about yourself because they know you the shit on top of the shit, and they don't want to tell you the shit. <laughs> so this could be this too. Also, this could be you, the Seven of Pentacles, you want to work on a relationship with someone, you want to, you're want trying to find a way how to work on a relationship with someone as well. Okay, like I said, you're trying to find a way how to get more money as well. Okay. Death card. This is a Scorpio. Someone's coming back to see you. This could be an ex, a family member, a friend, whosoever. This could be someone that goes to you and neglected you and banded you for a third party, had kids in you, marriage and all that. And now they coming back. They still in the third party, but they done cheated on that person. And, and, and God knows what. Now they want to come back to you. And see, would you give them a second chance? Or is it another chance? Or this could be someone you got kids about or ex or whoever. Okay, this person is very selfish. This person don't care who they hurt, who they walk all over like a sidewalk. They don't care who feelings they hurt or, you know, who they lied to, who they betrayed. This is someone that goes after what they want. They don't care. They selfish. They greedy. Okay? So be careful. Also, this could be new beginnings for you as well. You could be moving to new beginnings. You don't... The, bullshit the third party you're moving on you're moving forward you don't got time for the crap okay page of pentacles this is gonna be you looking for your money you're waiting on some money a check or something in the mail okay you can be checking your phone looking at your phone reading some text messages like i said you you're trying to get a loan you're trying to find a way how to get some money okay um like i said check money whatever you waiting on is coming okay yeah. Yep. Whatever you waiting on is coming. Money in the mail. This can be an earth sign or any sign. But you looking, you looking at something, you reading something, you checking something. You can be checking your bank account, your money. Also, this can be someone coming in to steal money from you as well, too. Okay. This can be someone checking your bank account, trying to break into your bank account. Someone trying to hack your phone, listen to your text message, read your text messages. Someone's trying to hack into your bank account, steal money from you, take money from you. Yes, or whatsoever. Okay. Like I said, Ace of Pentacles, money is coming, honey. Money is on the way. Okay. Whatever you've been waiting on, child support, uh, inheritance, the lawsuit, you uh, play the lottery, you might win the lottery, uh, surprises and gifts, your divine wish has been granted, has been heard. Whatever you pray for, ask God and you got an interest, your earth interest, your ancestors, your spirit guides for, it has been granted, it's on its way, honey. And that's what you're looking out for. It's coming, Page of Pentacles. Ha. All right, guys, I'm going to end this reading right here. Shut up. Ooh, wait. Okay, I'm just going to say this. Okay, be careful with a counselor. Page of Cups coming in wants to offer you out a drink and smoke and this and this and that. Don't accept it. Spirit said, listen to your intuition about this Page of Cups. Okay, this person wants to come and offer you something to drink and this and this and that. Be careful. This person might want sex from you. Or want to have sex with you, or uh, uh, just wants to, ha you know, uh, this person might try to set you up or trap you. Or what? So listen to your intuition, spirit said. Also, we got the five of swords. I mean, seven of swords. This is Aquarius. It's going to be any sign. Someone's coming in to take from you, steal from you. They're moving in silence. They're being sneaky, up to no good or whatsoever. So keep your guards up. This could be any sign. This is Aquarius. This could be any sign. Okay, guys? All right. So... Let me see. Like I said, you got a, a Leo that's watching you. Leo, fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius that's watching you. Looking at you. They can be looking at your pictures or whatsoever online. This can be an ex of yours. I found a member, a friend, a secret, a mighty who whatsoever. We got a devil card. This can be a Capricorn. A Virgo towards a Capricorn. Any sign. But someone is very toxic as hell. They're jealous and envy of you. And you need to get away from them. They're very deceptive. There's going to be some group of people that you're around. Uh, very negative and toxic. You got a Pisces that's that's attracted to you. Or like I said, you got more money on the way. Money is improving. You are protected in the name of Jesus, blood of Jesus, and the Holy Spirit. Okay? And you can be chosen. You can be a star to your earth angel or whatsoever. Money looks good. So whatever you've been manifesting, whatever you've been praying for, your divine wish has been granted. That means... Your spirit guides, your God, your angel, every angel, ancestor, all of them heard you. Okay. But yeah, the reading, 
looks good, but keep your guards up, okay? Collect the readings for all zodiac signs. Stay blessed and be blessed and smooches.